sadness. Fear is what makes the world go round. Fear is what powers the darkness. I bring it into the light. about change and how change can and will affect us all. And how I mentioned that the powers were changing and soon PewDiePie would no longer be on top. It'll be a corporation, just like YouTube wanted, just like YouTube continues to want, continues to feed subscribers to, continues to give them false subscribers, and continues to erase subscriber after subscriber who is subscribed to PewDiePie. And don't think that it's not happening, because it is. If you by chance are subscribed to PewDiePie, or you know you are subscribed to PewDiePie, take a look. Take a look about this time tomorrow. And see if you're still subscribed. And then continue to check until you realize, hey, wait a minute. I'm not subscribed to him anymore. YouTube will always go for the corporations. YouTube will never care about quality content from content creators like you and me. YouTube will continue to pander corporation greed over hard working people. People who are trying to do this as a job. Who's trying to make YouTube videos as a source of income and to use websites like Patreon or GoFundMe as a way of gaining insult, or excuse me, gaining income. And this isn't what YouTube wants. YouTube wants that money. That hard working money that you rightfully own. Soon, YouTube will make it harder for people like me and you who are trying to gain a large fan base. Right now, I don't have a lot of subscribers. 600, yeah, is a lot. But out of those 600, who is actually getting notified of my content. You have to go through so much just to get notified of my content. You have to go through pay, or no, you gotta go subscribe, you gotta hit the notifications bell, and then you gotta make sure that you're still subscribed to me. 
fully believe that YouTube has been deleting people's subscribers just to keep them on the down low. Ever since I embarked my journey to reach 1,000 subscribers, YouTube has put a brick wall in my way. God damn it, I am going to PUNCH through this brick wall and obliterate it. Why? Because I told the world that I am going to reach 1,000 subscribers this year. Whether it be it on YouTube or Twitch, and speaking of Twitch, Twitch is not alone. Twitch, you're not safe as well. Because soon, as soon as YouTube goes corrupt, who do you think will be next? Who do you think is next after YouTube? After YouTube has gone corrupt. Basically, I'm just going to put this out there. YouTube is already corrupt. It's up to me. It's up to me to save us all, isn't it? It's up to old one death eater, isn't it? Well, you know what? I'm done with it. I'm done with all of the lies and the deceit. And there's little truth in that. You see, the light of truth speaks for us all. Show the way. And the way is freedom. Freedom from corporations like Google, like Comcast, like T Series, like everything. Freedom to create anything we want without being threatened to get taken down just because someone didn't like our content or because somebody didn't like what we said. Isn't that against your terms of service, YouTube? Isn't that against the United States Constitution to deny freedom of speech? I couldn't rightfully sue. If anyone was to try to censor me, Because at the end of the day, it doesn't matter who you are, it matters what you do. And if you do nothing, then what do you honestly think the world is going to think of you? And I could say the same thing about me. Fear. YouTube is afraid. YouTube is scared that 
someone like me will exceed expectations, that I will eventually break that wall, reach 1,000 subscribers, and then what? You're going to raise it up to 5,000 subscribers and able to enable monetization on YouTube. YouTube does not want people like me to succeed. And I am going to show them why I will. It's far past due. And all anybody has to do is just click the subscribe button and click that notification bell and to continue to watch my content. It's YouTube's major flaw in the battle to try to keep me put down. And the battle to try to keep everybody else with free mind and free will down. Anybody who supports freedom of speech will continue to get put down as long as they're not supported. As long as they don't have a large enough community. I predict that in the next couple months we will see some changes to YouTube as Article 13 gets put into law all across the Europe. We will see a lot of big changes. And as net neutrality, excuse me, as net neutrality continues to get abolished. Companies like Comcast and AT&T will begin to regulate people like me and will be able to figuratively shut down my stream by simply turning off my voting. Which is a denial of service, which I can sue. And it's happened before. Not from me, not, not, not against me. But if it does happen against me, I will sue. I won't even hesitate to call to let you know that I'm going to get a lawyer and I'm going to I'm going to kindly ask why I was denied service but enough about me Enough about silly old me. What I want to know is what about you? What about all of you that I challenged oh so long ago? It feels like it's been a couple months now. And I still haven't gotten an answer, a reply, or even a whisper of an acceptance. None from the odd ones out, none from Alex Clark, not from Jaden Animations, not from anybody. Not even from the smallest YouTube. And all I wanted really was to prove a point. And I 
believe in a way I have. By not answering the call to battle. That is what this is. It is officially a battle. And you might not know who I am. But soon you will. Cross paths against me and you will soon find out that I am more dangerous than ever. Cross paths with me and you will soon find that you are outmatched against the power of one death eater. One and only weapon for one death eater. For this staff is capable of many things. This staff will be the end anyone who chooses to face me. Who will it be? Will it be you? Can you face the might the staff of truth as I transform it into the most powerful weapon of all mankind and all living life forms in this universe. The mighty sword Karag the sword of one death here. I grow tired of waiting. Come, face me, any of you. And I will show you no remorse, no disregard, no mercy. YouTube. Don't forget that you will never stop me.